Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to upload a PDF file to ChatGPT from your local computer. So I have already made a video tutorial on my channel on how to use the Ask Your PDF and the AI PDF and the Chat With Your PDF ChatGPT plugin. And these plugins are great, they are working fine, but based on user comments on under these YouTube videos, I found that some of the people are struggling with uploading PDF files from their local computer to ChatGPT. And there is a solution for that that I found. And you have to use the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin, which is also a plugin to upload PDFs to, to ChatGPT and then summarize those PDF documents. And the great feature of this Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin is that you can upload PDF file to your Google Drive and then share that Google Drive file with ChatGPT. And this way you don't have to upload the PDF to a public website where you can copy the URL of the PDF document. You can use your private Google Drive folders and basically anyone has access to Google Drives. So this is the way to upload PDFs from your local PC or Mac computer to ChatGPT. So before I would show you the complete process on how to upload PDFs to ChatGPT from your PC or Mac, I just want to let you know that if you want to learn more about the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin, I have a full tutorial on this plugin where I also share some of the best prompts you can use this plugin with. So if you're interested in more details, make sure to check out the article in the description below. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. But now let's see how to use the Access PDFs and Docs ChatGPT plugin to be able to upload PDFs from your local computer to ChatGPT. So first you have to make sure that you have enabled the plugin, the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin. And to be able to do that, first you have to enable the plugins feature in your account. And to enable plugins, you have to have a ChatGPT Plus subscription at the time of recording this video. Once you have enabled plugins, you have to click on new chat and select GPT-4 from the model selector. Then we have to install the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin. As you can see, it's installed for me because it is in this installed plugin list. If it's not for you, you have to scroll down, click on plugin store and search for the Access PDF and Docs plugin and install it. And last but not least, you have to enable the plugin and you can enable any plugin by clicking the checkbox next to the name of the plugin. All right, then all you have to do is open up your Google Drive of your Gmail account. So if you're not familiar, Google Drive is absolutely free to use. And we're gonna be able to upload our PDF files from our local computer here. And then we're gonna be able to share this PDF URL from the Google Drive with ChatGPT. So all you have to do is open up Google Drive and click on new, select file upload, then upload your PDF file you want to upload to ChatGPT. And as you can see, this file has been uploaded. If I open this up, I can show you that this is the official Bitcoin white paper by Satoshi Nakamoto, which is a technical paper on how Bitcoin and the blockchain works. And besides uploading, the only thing we have to do is that we have to make sure that the PDF document is shared with anyone who has access to the link. So the PDF document will still be a private document, so nobody is going to be able to access the document except people who have access to the link. And you can do that by clicking on the three dots here, then selecting share. And here you have to change the general access level from restricted to anyone with the link. Then you have to copy the link, click on done. And now we're going to be able to share this PDF with ChatGPT and no one else has access to this PDF document. So all we have to do is open up ChatGPT, make sure GPT-4 is selected and the plugin is enabled, then paste the URL of the Google Drive PDF document. And then let's add a really simple prompt, summarize this for me. So you can see that I'm not giving any kind of hint to ChatGPT that this is a Bitcoin white paper. So we can clearly see if it is able to parse the document and get the content of that PDF document and can then give us a summary based on the content of that document. 
So click on send message. So as you can see, you don't have to use any kind of function or code. If the plugin is enabled, ChatGPT will know that it has to use the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin to be able to scrape the content of this Bitcoin white paper. And if you click on this down arrow, you can clearly see that it has scraped the complete content of this PDF document. And based on that content, it's giving us a summary of this Bitcoin white paper by Satoshi Nakamoto. And if you read the main points here, you can see that this is a good summary of this research paper. So all in all, this is how you can upload PDF documents to ChatGPT from your local computer, whether it's a PC or Mac. All you need to have is a Google Drive document and use the Access PDF and Docs ChatGPT plugin like we are doing it right now. If you want to learn more about other ChatGPT plugins that can be used for summarizing PDFs, Google Docs documents, CSV files, or you just want to learn more about other ChatGPT plugins that can be used for finance, cryptocurrencies, data analysis, scientific research, marketing, business, finance, and a lot more. I have a ton of tutorials on my YouTube channel that you can check out and more are coming up. So make sure to subscribe. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions, and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.